my God, bro. We try to co-star this thing. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Ah! into the system it's going whenever you run that plate it's going to come back a stolen and that's when we're going to conduct a traffic stop on here man hopefully bro you got full coverage right yeah i do okay hopefully he doesn't try to run bro because that's when the car yeah he's going to probably wreck the car bro. hopefully not camera caught everything that happened bro they stole my car bro my car look at my window bro my car was literally parked right here, bro. They literally stole my fucking car, bro. I don't want to talk shit, but I told Peter the other day, these motherfuckers are coming here, they planning something. That's why that time I told him. Look at my fucking window, bro. My car was parked right here, literally right here. I always park my, my car right here. There's a camera right there, as you guys can see. So it can, you know, record my car you know just in case something like this happened these niggas came to my job to steal my car man now, i was watching a video i was watching a civilian video over and over and over and over and over i went to sleep that night late these niggas pretty much you know They've been watching me. They've been watching me. They've been watching me. And they're probably watching right now. <laughs> um, but what can we do? What's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. I'm back at it with another video. Uh, and this video, this video is going to be long. As you guys can see, this video is going to be a long video. How can I start this video, man? I can't even, I don't even know how to start this video, bro. It's it's like so much that I got to say. My mind been everywhere these past couple days. Uh, the reason why my mind been everywhere is because when I played this civilians video for you guys, uh, if you pay, you know, close attention to what's really going on on this video, um, you're gonna see that this people, see that, you know, been watching me on Instagram, See that these people have been watching me on YouTube, or it's somebody that I cut their hair and um, you know has sit in my chair and uh, has been watching me for I don't know how long. They've been watching me, and the reason why I said these these been watching me is because it took two cars to steal mine. Two cars came to steal my car, so I am guessing. There is a driver and a passenger and a driver and a passenger. Um, I'm going to play the video for you guys. And I want you guys to really, 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 really watch the video. Before we do that, there's not going to be a lot of editing on this video. Um, so if I mess up, I'm sorry. Uh, but, you know, I talked about this in a lot of my videos. Uh, maybe not a whole lot, but I did, you know, talk about it. You know your car being stolen thieves are you know are targeting these cars you are a target when you drive in a scat pack or a hellcat um you know i learned a whole lot from this situation maybe you know if i do own an, another dodge charger um you know i'm gonna move different you know be more alert uh maybe do some things to the car uh to track the car down you know and, and the thieves not knowing or maybe i can you know do something to the car where you know i can turn off the car from from my phone things like that i don't know what i'm gonna do you know i don't know if i'm gonna own another dodge charger 
Um, at this point, guys, um, I'm mad, but I'm not mad. But I'm mad because it's my shit. I work hard for that. You know what I'm saying? And for 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 somebody to come take your shit. So I'm gonna give you the rundown of what happened that day. So I'm cutting hair at the barbershop. Um, and I'm cutting one of my boys. So I'm done cutting his hair. He tells me, Gordo, let's go outside. Gordo means fat boy. He tells me, Gordo, let's go outside. I'm like, yo, I got three more people, man. I can't go outside right now. Soon he goes outside. And he's, you know, he's, you know, he's smoking his cigarette. He's walking back and forth. He sees my car driving by the barbershop. Literally, you know, they it drives right in front of the barbershop because the barbershop is facing a one way, uh, you know, road. Like, you know, you can only go this way. You know, you have to make a U turn in order to get on the highway, or you can keep going and get on the highway. So we facing the highway. So there's nothing for these niggas to, you know. To steal the car and you know hop right on the highway. Um, the way these people did it, you know, they 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 know what they were doing. It wasn't like you know they didn't know what they were doing. They they stole the car in less than two minutes, literally. That's how fast they stole the car. And when I play the video, it's a Toyota Camry, and it looks like a Cadillac SUV. I'm not sure, but I. I watched the video so many times that I saw the car like, bro, and it's hard to see these cars, right? Because you really have to watch the video. But I'm, you know, you guys gonna see it because I'm telling you, but it's a Camry, it's two, two cars, a Toyota Camry and it's a Cadillac. The Toyota Camry made his way around the shop watching me. Watch the video. You guys saw that, man. They literally just came to my job and took my car. 
it's crazy, man, that, you know, you can't own anything in life, man. You can't have nothing nice, you know. Uh, people want what you got. And it's really true, man. People really do want what you got, bro. This is just, you know, a learning situation. I'll learn from this. Um, and, you know, like I said, you know, uh, I talked to the... I, I talked about this on previous videos, you know, uh, it is dangerous to own a Dodge Charger. It is, you know, these cars are the type of car you can, you know, take somebody's life or somebody will take your life. You know, it can get that serious with these cars, man. And, um, you know, I don't know if I'm going to own the Hellcat guys. I don't know if you guys are going to see another Dodge vehicle on this channel. I don't know where I'm going to go from here. You know, I'm going to take some time off from, you know, from doing videos. I probably will post a video here and there, but it's not going to be, you know, like this. You know, uh, I, I had a big uh, goal, you know, to uh, to accomplish uh, by, you know, the summer and it was to, you know, to get to 5,000 subscribers, you know, and it was a small goal. It was something that, you know, it can be very possible to do. Um, but you know, I like to set goals because I like to keep going, you know, and, um, you know, a lot of you guys probably are not going to come back to the channel because, you know, this is a car channel, but I don't think you guys are going to see another Dodge on this channel. Um, I don't know where I'm going to go from here. Uh, I don't think that I'm going to, you know, get myself right now in another loan. Uh, I'm just going to, you know, relax, chill and, uh, just do my thing, you know, stay more, you know, stay more stay more uh low key and um you know just be more alert guys right now you know my mind been everywhere i've been you know everywhere i go it's like i i, I, I you know everybody's a suspect to me yesterday i was cutting here and i'm looking at every single customer as a suspect you know i'm looking at customers like you know like you did it you know what i'm saying because i don't know who did it i don't know who did it and i feel like the person that did it you know been watching me you know and that's something that you know you take it more personal because they been watching me, you know, they been watching me. Like, where you been watching me from? Like YouTube, the Instagram, you know, you met me at the shop and you got a hurka by me or you got a hurka by one of the other uh, barbers and you found out that I had, you know, a Dodge Charger. Um, so I don't know. I don't know where we're going to go from here, guys. Uh, I love these cars, but uh, they not worth it. I don't know why Dodge is selling people. Uh, you know, a car like the Hellcat, a car like the Scat Pack, a car like that, you know, fifty thousand, sixty thousand, a hundred thousand dollars car and their security system is, you know, it's some bullshit. You know, how can you steal this car so easy? Well, this is straight bullshit. You know, how the hell you make a car, you know, and you you know, you taxing people out here, it's, you know, because the Hellcat easy is eighty thousand dollars right now. Why buddy? You selling an eighty thousand dollar car for somebody to steal your car in less than two minutes, you know? And then go and strip your car down, you know what I'm saying? Pretty much violate your shit. Yes, the insurance gonna pay for it, but bro, it's your shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? You, 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 you did respect me. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, that that's your hard work and money, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, people don't really know how to get it out of the mud, but this is a learning situation. Like I said, I'm gonna learn from this and um, just be more careful and be more alert. And, uh, man, like I said, guys, you know, I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys probably ain't going to come back, which is all good, you know, because you guys came here for the car content. You know, you guys subscribe because you wanted to see car content. But, guys, I don't know where this is going to go from here. You know, I'm I'm back in square one when I first started YouTube. Now I got to get more creative. I have to think outside of the box. I have to really, you know, think, you know, right now for, you know, for different content and come up with different ideas to make content because I don't want to quit on YouTube. You know, I really don't, you know, I'm, I'm going to take some time off, but that does not mean that I'm going to quit on YouTube. I, I, I'm the type of person I don't quit. I'm not going to stop me, bro. No matter what, I don't care about none of that, bro. I don't care about none of that. You know, it's it just life, bro. You know what I'm saying? Shit like that happens. And you know what I'm saying? You just got to be prepared for shit like that to happen. And you know, move different, you know, and I'm going to move different. I'm going to learn from this. And you know, I never thought it would happen to me. You feel what I'm saying? I never thought it would happen to me, but what can I do, bro? Uh, in the past couple of days, my mind been everywhere. I've been, you know, I've been at work, um, you know, thinking. I've been home thinking, and uh, and you right now, bro. I I have realized who's there for me, who's not, and who's real and who's not. You know what I'm saying? Everybody wanna, everybody wanna, you know, hear from you when 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 something bad happens. People don't wanna know good news, bro. People wanna know bad news. You know what I'm saying? And um, you know, this right here, you know, kind of opened my eyes even more. 
uh, to what really going on out here. Um, there's fake people out here. There's haters. And there is, you know, there's people out here that don't want to see you doing good, bro. Um, there is people out here that really want what you got. And there's people out here that envy what you got and envy that, you know, that you doing good and then you doing big things, you know, just, you know, falling back for a little bit and, uh, you know, just chill, man. You know, I feel like just chilling, you know, just, I don't want to get, I don't want to get another Dodge. I'm going to go to the dealership and cancel that order. I don't want to own a Dodge, guys. I, I, don't, I don't think it's worth it. Uh, you know, like you guys know, I was about to get the Hellcat, um, but I don't think I'm gonna do it. Uh, you know, I'm I'm just gonna you know relax, chill. Uh, I'm probably go somewhere else, guys. I don't I don't I think I'm done with Dodge. You know, as fun as they is, they they beautiful. You know, and, and I like my car, and you know I, I put so much money into it, and in in, in in time and effort. But uh, you know, it's not worth it because at the end of the day, you losing money. You know, at the end of the day. You know, whether the insurance is paying for it, you know, you still losing money. Knowing that you a target, you know, all that, you know, is it really worth it? Is it really worth it? You putting your life in danger, you know, you hurting somebody or somebody hurting you. Is it really worth it? You know what I'm saying? I don't think it's worth it. I think that, you know, it's time to move on. And, uh, man, you know, I appreciate everybody for coming to the channel. I appreciate all my subscribers, man. And, uh, guys, you know, we're just going to keep pushing, man. We're going to move on from this. And um, it will be better days and there will be better things coming, you know. So, you know, I'm, 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 I'm staying as positive. Yeah, I'm, I'm staying as positive as possible uh, with this situation because, you know, rainy days don't last long. You know, they're temporary, you know. Rainy days, they don't last long. You know, they only temporary. They come and go. And, um, you know, we'll, 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 we'll get through this, you know. And I thank you guys so much for the support. I thank you guys so much for the love. And, um, you know, it will be something different coming to the channel. Yeah, I don't think we will have another Dodge in the house. I think we are done with these cars, and uh, it's time to move on, you guys. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys soon. Take care.